Explore the full potential of Schoology rubrics with these advanced options and techniques. Here, we'll continue editing the rubric we began in Part 2, this time from directly within an assignment. Once created, a rubric can be edited anywhere within a course. Let's use a standard scale across these criteria. Use the Apply Point Scale option to apply a point scale to all of the rubric's criteria simultaneously. With Schoology Enterprise, set up system-wide grading scales. These will be pre-populated in all courses to reduce the work required from teachers and faculty. Any criterion's description or point scale can be customized at any time. Differentiating point values can help you weight criteria within the rubric. Feel free to use decimals as well as whole numbers. This criterion is for timeliness. Instead of awarding points, you may deduct points instead. Simply use negative numbers. Looking to award extra credit? Simply include a row with zero points and manually enter points while grading. Update the criteria order. Drag and drop rows by grabbing the handle on the left side and pulling them up or down. Save the rubric. This may now be used throughout the course, copied to other courses, or saved to your resources. Attach this rubric to an assignment from the Scale Rubric drop-down menu. By default, your students will automatically see the scoring rubric directly beneath the directions. You may disable the student view by unchecking this box. Notice that the total points for this assignment have been locked to equal the total points in the rubric. With these techniques, your expectations are made clear and grading will be streamlined. Just click or tap in the browser or Schoology mobile app using your completed rubric.